Rubble is heading off for a much needed holiday. So today's building work is up to Diggly and Daisy. And today they need to build a brick wall. That looks pretty easy. Time to get started. Daisy thinks they should start the wall here. Oh, Diggly doesn't think so. He thinks they should start here. Daisy doesn't agree. Maybe they could start in the middle. Diggly and Daisy disagree. They're not going to work together. And poor CJ is stuck in the middle. Diggly and Daisy are each going to build their own wall the way they think it should be built. Each of them wants their wall to be the best. They're building faster and faster. Poor CJ is struggling to keep up with all the cement they need. Something is wrong. They've been so focused on their own walls that now they've trapped themselves in. Mm, this is no good. But I think Daisy has an idea. Yes, Diggly agrees. They shouldn't fight. They should work together to fix the problem. Daisy has knocked her bit of the wall down. Now Diggly is knocking his down too. There, now they can start over again. But this time, Diggly and Daisy will work together and build one big wall that will be nice and strong. They put all the bricks in place. Hooray! The wall is finished! Daisy's happy with it. And so is Diggly. Good teamwork, guys. CJ is so happy they're friends again. Look, it's Diggly. I think he wants to lift that big girder. There's Johnny. He has no problem lifting heavy loads. He's tall and strong. But Diggly is only little. And that girder is very heavy. Oh, Diggly can't reach high enough. Poor Diggly. Here's Dozer. He wants to cheer Diggly up. Being big and strong isn't everything. Everybody has different things they're good at. There's no need to be upset. I think Diggly has a plan. He's got a barrel. And Dozer has a plank of wood. Now Diggly's up on the roof. Dozer's put a crate of bricks on the plank. Is it a seesaw? Oh, I see. It's a catapult. They can use it to bounce bricks up onto the roof. Very clever, Diggly. Johnny is still lifting the heavy bricks up onto the roof. But look, Diggly can bounce them up easily. He's using his brain to solve a problem. Look, now Daisy wants a turn. It's so much fun using Diggly's new invention. They'll have moved all the bricks in no time. Diggly may not be the strongest or the tallest, but he can be a very big help if he tries hard. Well done, Diggly. Diggly is arriving at Construction HQ. The gang are about to find out what they're building today. Wow, is that a racetrack? Now this is going to be fun. They are placing the winner's podium onto the course. What was that? Now it's complete. Mr. Rubble wants them to test out the course. Daisy is so excited. She's very fast. On your marks, get set, go! They're approaching the first corner and Daisy's in the lead. She's zooming ahead. Watch out, Mr. Rubble. She flies across the ramp. Careful, Bump. Hmm, this ramp isn't as easy for everyone else. Diggly is a bit slower because he's got one track smaller than the other. 
Daisy doesn't think this race is fair. She spotted some bricks left over from the build. Aha! Looks like she's got an idea. Daisy wants Diggly to feel more included. Bump and Daisy have attached some bricks to their tracks to make the race more fun. Now Diggly doesn't have to feel left out. Go, go, go! Off they go around the corner. Wow! Everyone is equally fast. They're going up the ramp. Everyone is having so much fun. Around the bend. I wonder who's going to win. They're coming up to the finish line and Bump is the winner. Hooray! What a brilliant race. Well done, everyone. That was great. Races are much more exciting when everyone is included. It's a windy day at Construction HQ. That's a cool windmill, Daisy. And today, they're going to be building a wind turbine. Awesome! They need to attach a propeller to the pole at the top of that hill. Daisy's carrying the propeller up, but it's a bit windy. Whoa! Be careful! Oh dear! The wind blew her straight off the hill. But Bump will help Daisy get back up. Phew, the propeller is okay. Diggly and Daisy are trying again. Diggly is helping this time. Mr. Rubble isn't happy about all this mess. Time for Bump to get to work. The wind is back, but Bump has noticed that the wind sock flies whenever it's windy. Diggly and Daisy are being blown down the hill again. The wind is back and Bump is signalling to tell them to stop carrying the propeller. Looks like it worked! Now it's stopped, they can carry on. Go! 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 Stop! What brilliant teamwork! Hooray! They made it to the top of the hill! Whoa! That was a close one! Now it's time to attach it to the pole! It worked! Great job team! And look! It's powering the city's lights! How amazing! It was definitely worth all that work! It's Dozer, CJ and Diggly! Looks like they've just finished building a brand new house. Good work, guys. But something's not right. Something is still missing. Of course. They need to colour the house in with paints. And that big paint mixing machine. Red first. Diggly is off. He's mixing the paint in the mixer. Ah. CJ is collecting it in her drum. She's giving the red paint to Diggly. And bingo, the roof is red. Well done, guys. Next up is blue. We have to mix it up. CJ collects the paint, gives it to Diggly and... There we go, the windows are blue. Nice work, Diggly. Which colour next? Yellow. Uh-oh, Diggly accidentally knocked the green paint over. That's not good. Diggly's mixing the yellow paint. He's painting the door yellow, but I don't think he realises the green paint is spilled. <gasps> All gone. How will they finish painting now? Wait a minute. When the blue and yellow paints mix, it makes green. So if they take the yellow and blue paint cans and put them both in the mixer, there, green paint. Nice work. Now you can finish painting the house. There, green.
green walls. The house is finished. Well done, Diggly Dozer and CJ. Hey, look. It's all the construction vehicles. Looks like they're repairing the road by Old McDonald's Farm. See? Diggly and CJ are filling the pit with fresh concrete. Cool. What is it, Diggly? Oh, no! The barn is on fire. Oh, phew. Here comes Ashley the fire truck. Wait, Ashley, look out. The concrete is still wet. Oh, no. Ashley's got stuck in the concrete. How will we put the fire out now? Johnny and Dozer are trying to get Ashley out. But be careful, guys. You'll get stuck too. Oh, no. The fire is still burning. What are we going to do? Wait a minute. I think Diggly has an idea. Wow, they're going to use all those pipes to form one long pipe. <laughs> then they're going to point it at the barn. And then go, Ashley! The water is travelling all the way down the pipe. There, the fire is put out. Way to go, Diggly. Now Diggly is digging Ashley out of the concrete. Everything is safe and sound now. Good job, everyone. Hey, it's Diggly. Time for a hard day's work on the construction site. But wait, what has Diggly seen? Oh, wow, a robot digger. I wonder what that's doing here. Johnny is going to turn the machine on. Oh, that's it. The robot looks ready to work. Now the construction vehicles are hard at work. Diggly is digging a trench, but now the robot digger is here to help. Look out, Diggly. The robot is digging very fast. Best to stay out of its way. Look at the robot digger go. Dozer has to move fast to keep up. Whoa, the robot digger has finished its job already. Oh, poor Diggly. He feels useless now that the robot has done his job for him. What's this? A drip of water has hit the robot. I don't think the robot is waterproof. Oh no, it's going haywire. It's smashing up all the construction sites. Somebody needs to stop it. Diggly and Dozer are jumping into action. Dozer is holding the robot back, but he can't hold it forever. Quick, Diggly. Phew, the robot is off. Well done, Diggly and Dozer. You saved the day. But what can we do with the robot now? It's a very hot day today. Oh, Diggly has turned the robot digger into a robot fan. How very clever of him. Wow, it's a wonderful snowy day at Construction HQ. What are they building today? A gingerbread house? Mmm, tasty. Look at all that gingerbread. Ooh. They're building the house at the top of that hill. Whoa! It's a long way up and a steep climb. Be careful, Bump. Oh no! A piece of gingerbread has snapped. But Mrs Skip is collecting the pieces. I wonder why. They're at the top. It's time to build. Go team! Good job, Diggly and Daisy. Now CJ is gluing the walls together with icing sugar. Be 
careful, Daisy. That gingerbread breaks very easily. Uh-oh. CJ's to the rescue. Watch out, Mr. Rubble. <laughs> oh, dear. Digley is lifting the next piece. Oh, no. Not again. Be careful, everyone. This is very tricky. The gingerbread keeps breaking. They're working as a team to glue the broken pieces back together. It worked! Wow! Look at that gingerbread house. That was great teamwork, everyone. It looks very tasty. Nope, Daisy. This gingerbread isn't for eating. But Mrs. Skip has made snacks out of the broken gingerbread pieces. Yippee! Now this gingerbread you can eat, Daisy. Yum, yum. Delicious. Digley and Daisy are finishing up the gingerbread house on top of the big hill. Hmm, I wonder what Digley is up to. Oops, that was close, Daisy. There's Mr. Rubble, all the way down at the bottom of the hill. He's putting up a sign to show the way to the gingerbread house. But where's Digley gone? Oh, he has made a welcome sign for the gingerbread house. Nice work. It looks great. Daisy loves it. Uh-oh, Daisy knocked the boulder down the hill and it's turning into a giant snowball. It's heading straight for Mr. Rubble and he hasn't noticed. What are they going to do? Daisy has an idea. Whoa! They're using Digley's sign as a sled. And now they're racing down the hill. Watch out for that tree. Good steering, Digley. That was a close one. Looks like Mr. Rubble still has no idea. Keep going, guys. You're nearly there. Watch out. Oh, no. They've tripped over that rock. How will they catch up with the snowball now? Digley is determined to keep going. Oh no, the snowball is getting closer. Quick guys, there's no time to lose. Daisy has spotted something ahead, a snowbank. Look at them fly. Now they're ahead of the snowball. They can use the sign as a ramp. It worked. Brilliant idea, guys. Phew. Digley and Daisy saved the day, just in time. And Mr. Rubble didn't even notice anything was wrong. Great work, team. Look, it's the town zoo. And there's Bandit Bus. What's he up to this time? Oh, no. He's unlocking the zoo doors. And now he's opening them. The zoo animals might escape. Oh dear, that baby lion has just got out. Hey, it's Digley and Daisy, driving along oh. the road. And there's Tony the truck. Hi, Tony. They've all got work to do. Tony's on his way to deliver some boxes. Look, the baby lion. Tony is scared. He's running away. Oh. Digley and Daisy wonder what he's running from. Hmm. Oh. The baby lion is still there. Digley and Daisy are frightened. Lions can be dangerous. But they can't just leave him to roam free. He needs to go back to the zoo. I think Digley has a plan. Look, a toy mouse on a string. The baby lion is chasing it. He'll follow it anywhere. Oh, I see. <laughs> Digley and Daisy are pulling the string. They're going to use it to lead the baby lion all the way back to the zoo. Ooh. Oops. Daisy's knocked the sign. Now they don't know which way the zoo is. Maybe it's this way? Oh, dear. They've gone round in a circle. Well, maybe it's this way. Oh. Maybe not. Hmm. Oh no! The baby lion has caught up! But wait, he doesn't seem so scary. He just wants to play. Ooh. There, 
The baby lion is back at the zoo, <laughs> safe and sound. Good job, Diggly and Daisy. It's another busy day at Construction HQ. And Mr Rubble is in a rush. Oops! Careful! Bump's block tower looks wobbly. <gasps> What's that sound? Let's go check it out. It's Iggy the ice cream truck. Oh, yum! That looks delicious. The crew are going to grab an ice cream as well. Oh, no! CJ accidentally knocked into Bump's block tower and now it's blocking their way out. How are they going to get an ice cream now? Daisy has an idea. She's built a ramp over the fence. That's very clever. Go on, CJ. She's got to the top. But oh no, it wasn't strong enough. Daisy has another idea. Oh, a seesaw. They can use it to bounce over the fence. Whoa, look at Diggly go. They're bouncing really high, but this might not help them get out. Diggly is on the case. He's digging a hole so they can get out under the fence. Off he goes. Did he reach the ice cream van? Ah, oh, a lion. This must be the zoo. One last go. They're going to knock the fence down together. Go, go, go. They did it. Well done, everyone. And there's Iggy the ice cream truck. Finally, they can get their ice cream. Mmm, yummy. Another? Yay! That was so much fun. But who's that? It's Mr. Rubble. He was off getting ice cream for the gang. Uh-oh. It looks like they've got some cleaning up to do now. Look, it's the construction crew and they're building a castle. Diggly is directing Daisy as she lifts a big heavy block and puts it in place. CJ squirts the cement and... Done! One, two, three, four, five blocks on one side and one, two on the other. They're going to need some more blocks. Go, go, Dozer! <laughs> One, two, three blocks across the drawbridge. Good job, Dozer. Oh no, it's a scary shark. Whoops. One of the blocks has fallen into the water. Poor Dozer, it was just an accident. Now Daisy has to lift the blocks into place. One, two blocks are left. They're really heavy. Careful, Daisy. Oops, they'll smash up. Oh no, Daisy's music got turned up really loud. She dropped the blocks. Phew, Diggly caught one of the blocks. But oh dear, the other smashed. How many are left? One, two, three, four, five on one side. One, two, three on the other. Oh dear, they don't match. But wait. I think Diggly has an idea. What's he up to? He's taking a block from the toddler tower. Five minus one is four. Now he's adding the block to the shorter tower. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. They match. Nice work, Diggly. It's another windy day at Construction HQ. That wind really is blowing today. But today they're building a bigger enclosure for the sheep at the farm. Oh dear. The old sheep enclosure is far too small. Good job they're building a new one. That wind really is cold. And whoa, strong as well. But wait, what's Diggly seeing? Look. It's an old farm windmill, but it's wobbling all over the place in the wind. I think it's going to collapse. They have to stop it falling onto the sheep. Phew. Good job, Daisy. Now it's falling towards the pigs. Uh-oh. Look out. Phew. Daisy saved us again. 
Now it's falling back towards the sheep again. Oh dear. This is no good at all. What are they going to do? Wait. I think Diggly has an idea. Hmm. Diggly's climbed up on a box. He's taken the wheel off the top. Ah. He's taking the old tower apart from the top down. So it can't fall over and hurt anyone. In no time at all, they've taken the tower apart. Now what can they do with all these planks of wood? They can recycle all the old planks from the tower and use them to build a bigger pen for the sheep. It's always good to build something new out of something old, instead of throwing things away. There, now the sheep have a much bigger place to play. Good job everyone! It's still a bit windy. Uh oh, Mr. Rubble's hat. One of the sheep has it. Now he's got to get it. It's a boiling hot day at Construction HQ, and the gang are very hot and bothered. But there's no time to rest. They've got a busy day ahead. What's Daisy spotted outside? Oh no! It's a fire! And it set off the fire alarm! Here comes Ashley the fire truck. Can she put the fire out? Sure she can. Phew! Hooray for Ashley! And off she goes to help some more people across town. Bye Ashley! Thank you! Oh no! Another fire started. And there goes the alarm! It's even bigger this time! Where's Ashley the fire truck? Oh no! Don't worry, Diggly has a plan! He's filling up his digger with water! He's trying to put out the fire! Good idea, Diggly! Mr. Rubble wants to help too. Whoops! Be careful, CJ. CJ has loaded up her cement mixer with water. Watch your water on the floor, Mr. Rubble. Whoops! Oh no! The fire is spreading towards the building. What are they going to do? Daisy's got a plan. She knocked the tower into the wood and stopped the fire spreading. Hooray for Daisy! Splash! The fire is all gone. And here's Ashley. Don't worry, Ashley. The fire is out. Even if they did make a bit of a mess. The whole construction crew are getting ready for today's job. They're building that crumbly old building. That can't be right. Oh! They're demolishing the building. Daisy is so excited. Soon enough, it's time to get to work. The building looks like it could fall down any moment. It'll be safer to knock it down. Everyone is ready to get started. But wait! Stop everyone! There's a little kitten beside it. Oh no! The kitten could get hurt if they knock it down now. Phew! Diggly stopped them just in time. They need to get the kitten out of harm's way. She's so cute. Ooh! I think Mr. Rubble's afraid of cats. The kitten ran back inside. Oh dear. They can't knock down the building with the kitten inside. Diggly's trying to get her to come out with some milk. Daisy wants to pet the kitten, but Diggly thinks that will frighten her. Oh no, Daisy accidentally hit the building. I think it's going to collapse, but the cat is still inside. What will they do? Maybe Mr. Rubble can help, but he'll have to face his fear of cats. <gasps> Mr. Rubble is small enough to fit inside. Phew, 
Mr. Rubble saved the kitten. And just in time, that was a close one. Mr. Rubble was very brave to rescue the kitten. I think he's got over his fear of cats now. He's made a friend. It's Christmas time at Construction HQ and everyone is really excited. But first they have work to do. They need to build a present wrapping machine. The presents go in here and come out here. But wait. They're building this for Santa? Diggly and Daisy are so excited. They might even get to meet Santa. Wow, in no time at all, the present wrapping machine is almost finished. Now it's time to test it. Diggly pulls the lever. Mr. Rubble puts the toy on the conveyor belt. And out it comes all wrapped up. Pop! Oops, uh-oh. Now the machine is running backwards. Oh dear, oh dear. Diggly's trying to turn the machine off. Oh no, now it's running faster. It's sucking the toys up. Oh no, it sucks Mr. Rubble up. Diggly and Daisy are trying to stop it. But they're not working together. Mr. Rubble's wrapped up like a present. But who's this? It's Santa. He can fix this mess. Santa snaps his fingers and... Phew, the machine is fixed. There's Mr. Rubble. He's still wrapped up. Phew, that's much better. Dickley and Daisy are sorry the machine went wrong. But it's okay. Santa knows just how to cheer them up. Whoa, a present eats for Diggly and Daisy. Amazing. <laughs> Merry Christmas, everyone. It's a bright sunny day at Construction HQ. Everyone is excited to start work. Today, they need to repair an old bridge that's collapsed in the middle. That'll be fun. The team arrive happily at the broken bridge. Wow, look at all the holes but they need to get their planks at the far side to fix it. Where's Daisy going? Whoa! Mr. Rubble almost got knocked over the edge. Daisy can't get over the gap, but maybe she can reach the planks with a hook. Oh, nearly? Give it another go. Oh no, she's knocked it into the river, but at least Daisy tried. What are they going to do now? Diggly's got it. He's going to try and reach across. Watch out, the plank is collapsing. Phew, great save Daisy. But how are they going to get across and get those planks? Wait a minute, I think Diggly has a plan. Watching Daisy's hook swing back and forth. Oh, they're going to swing Mr. Rubble over the gap. That's a long way down, and Mr. Rubble doesn't like heights. He's nervous, but Diggly and CJ are encouraging him. Go on, Mr. Rubble, be brave, you can do it. Mr. Rubble is swinging. This isn't so bad, it's actually great fun. He's having a great time. He can grab the planks on that side and deliver them to the crew on the other side. Now, with a bit of cement to stick it, the bridge will be repaired in no time. There, all done. Good job, team. But look. Mr. Rubble is still swinging. He's having so much fun, he doesn't want to stop. Today, Mr. Rubble has an exciting plan for the crew. Hang on. That's not the right plan. Aha! Uh -huh. There it is. They're building a park. The crew are ready to get started. First, they need to knock down the old building. That's an easy task for Daisy. She's nearly finished knocking it down. Huh? What's that? 
Little frogs? Where did you come from? This park is their home. The crew can't build here. Where would the frogs live? Don't worry, gang. Bump has an idea. He's distracting Mr. Rubble. While Diggly and Daisy make some changes to Mr. Rubble's plan. They're building a new home for these five little frogs. Sorry, Mr. Rubble. First, Diggly is cleaning up the pond, making it nice and clean. The frogs look very happy about this. Next, they've got to lay some fresh grass. Whoa! Great teamwork, guys! Oh no! Mr. Rubble has realised their plan to add a pond. He's not happy. Well, well, well. He likes the changes after all. The park looks amazing. And the frogs love it. What a beautiful new home for some very cheeky little frogs. What are the construction crew up to today? An obstacle course? That looks like so much fun. Diggly is digging a hole. And it looks like Bump is putting a ramp in place. The crew are all lined up and ready to test it out. The first one to get to the finish line gets that shiny trophy. Ready, set, go! CJ's in the lead. She's looking pretty fast. Diggly is a bit behind, but he's trying his best. Oh no! CJ has gone face first into the mud pit obstacle and is now stuck in the mud. Now Bump is in the lead. The mud is no problem for his big crawler tracks. Up the ramp. Now it's time to cross the narrow bridge. Bump is up first. What was that? A wrecking ball? Oops! Bad luck, Bump. Mrs. Skip is controlling the wrecking ball as another obstacle to get past. Nice dodge, Daisy. You can't beat a wrecking ball with a wrecking ball. Whoa! What knocked CJ over? It's Mr. Rubble. He's using a paint blaster to try and knock them off. Daisy's really good at dodging them. Careful, Diggly. Phew. He caught himself on the monkey bars. He might be slow on his crawler tracks, but he's super fast when he's using his strong arm. Diggly and Daisy are almost at the finish line. It's so close. They've just got to get down the ramp. Whoa! They crossed the line together. Looks like they both came in first place. Well done, guys. It's a cold winter's day and it's been snowing. Diggly is making sure everyone is nice and warm by putting their woolly hats on. One for Bump. And one for Daisy. Oh no, the hat doesn't fit Daisy. But she's so excited to play in the snow that she leaves without it. Wow, it's very cold today. Daisy is a bit chilly. Everyone is having so much fun. Well, not everyone. Amber is trapped by the snow. Not to worry, the gang are here to save the day. Whoa, that was a big sneeze, Daisy. She's feeling a little bit poorly. Bump is clearing the way. Oops! Oh dear! Daisy is very cold and not feeling well at all. Poor Daisy. Nope. Amber says she needs to get some rest. They can finish the job tomorrow. Daisy is warming up by the fire and is feeling a little bit better now. 
Mrs Skip has an idea. She's going to knit some new hats for the gang. Wow, what a lovely hat. Daisy is feeling much better now. She's had some rest and a new hat is keeping her warm. Go on, Daisy. She is back to her usual self. Hooray! The gang are getting ready for Halloween. And today, they're building a pumpkin stand at the farm. Diggly is putting on the finishing touches. Oh look, it's Terry Tractor. He looks very happy with his new stand. Oops, all the pumpkins are falling. Oh dear, Daisy is covered in pumpkin. She looks a bit scary. She looks like a pumpkin monster. Look, it's Buster and Scout. Ah! Daisy has scared them away. Hmm, it's given Daisy an idea. Buster and Scout are terrified of the pumpkin monster. There it is. Diggly knows it's only Daisy, and it's given him an idea for a prank as well. Daisy is trying to scare Diggly. But what's that? Boo! Don't worry, Daisy. It was just Scout, Diggly and Buster, dressed up like pumpkins. Here's Terry the tractor to check up on them. What's all this? What a scary bunch! Terry is rewarding them all for their hard work with a fruit basket. Yum yum! It's a winter's day at the construction HQ and all the crew are excited to get to work. Oh, today they're building a windmill. Hooray! But, oh dear, those dark clouds don't look good. They'd better get to work fast. In no time at all, the windmill is almost finished. Now the sails are on too. Now to test it. But wait, it's snowing. It's snowing a lot. Oh dear. Mr Rubble says they need to go inside or they'll catch colds. Diggly wants to play in the snow, but he has to go inside. The next morning, everyone is ready to get back to work. Oh look, there's so much snow outside. Oops, I don't think that'll work, Mr Rubble. Diggly can dig a path through the snow. There, now they need to reach the windmill. Almost there. There, but the button is frozen up. This looks like a job for Daisy. There, no problem. Whoa! The windmill is blowing all the snow away. Great work, everyone. Now they have time to play. They can all slide down the snow drifts. Hooray! It's almost Christmas and the construction crew are building the Christmas market. There is so much to do. Everyone is really busy. What's that, Mr Rubble? Is that a brand new entrance built out of coloured blocks for the market? Amazing! Here comes Bump with the blocks. Wow, they look heavy. 
What's Stiggly doing? He can't get it to stay still. Bump is going to help him. Teamwork is the key. Wow, that big hit made everything shake. Oh no, the blocks are rolling away. Now the wagon is stuck on the frozen pond. What are they going to do? What's that sound? Oh no, the blocks fell through the ice and sank into the pond. How will they build the arch now? Poor Mr. Rubble. Daisy seems to have an idea. Hmm. What is she up to? Whoa! Daisy made a block out of ice. What an amazing idea. They can use the ice blocks to build the arch. Daisy is getting them out of the pond and Diggly is making the arch. Last few for CJ to move. They made it! Here comes Mr. Rubble! Yay! He looks so happy! Well done, everyone! Diggly and Daisy are so excited for Halloween! They can't wait to go trick or treating tonight! Oh, but. Oh dear! Mr. Rubble says they've still got work to do! Diggly and Daisy are working hard on the construction site. There's Buster and Scout going trick-or-treating. Diggly and Daisy wish that they could join them. Here comes Mrs. Skip. Look, she's given them Halloween masks. That's given Daisy an idea. What's that noise? Trick-or-treat! Daisy is trick-or-treating Mr. Rubble and he doesn't recognise her. He's given her some sweets. Maybe they can go trick-or-treating after all. Ooh. <laughs> now Diggly's going to try. Trick-or-treat! Mr. Rubble doesn't recognise Diggly either, so gives him some sweets. Ah. But, hmm, that trick-or-treater looked mm. kind of familiar. Mr. Rubble's going to investigate. Uh-oh. Daisy's hiding, Diggly's running. Mr. Rubble thinks something funny is going on. A trail of sweets. He's chasing after Diggly. Oops. Oh dear, Mr. Rubble found them. He caught them playing instead of working. But, oh, he's brought them some more sweets. Mr. Rubble is a big softy, really. Now he's letting Diggly and Daisy go trick or treating. Happy Halloween, everyone. What are the construction crew up to today? Whoa, a giant Easter egg. <laughs> Everyone is hard at work preparing for the giant chocolate egg. Daisy and Mrs. Skip are mixing the perfect chocolatey blend. Good work, CJ. Time to fill the mould up with all that lovely chocolate. There's Buster. He's excited to dig into his own chocolate egg. Whoops! Watch out! Oh no! Where did Mr. Rubble go? Careful, Buster! <gasps> Mr. Rubble is trapped inside the giant chocolate egg. What's he going to do? The egg looks amazing. But what's making that noise inside the egg? It's Mr. Rubble trying to get out. The giant egg has broken free. Watch out! Quick, guys, catch it if you can. You. Good catch, CJ. Uh-oh, the egg is rolling out of control and it's making a huge mess. 
Watch out! Good swing, Daisy. Look out! Here it comes! Mr. Rubble is free! Oh, but the chocolate egg is broken. CJ has an idea. They're mixing up some chocolate glue to put it back together. What a great idea! There, good as new. And Buster's still got to have some chocolate. What an adventure! It's a summery day at Construction HQ. What's happening? Mr. Rubble seems very nervous. They're off on holiday to the beach! Hooray! <laughs> Mr. Rubble was just tricking them. <laughs> Diggly is building a sandcastle. Whoa! Daisy's sandcastle is huge. Diggly wishes his sandcastle was that big. Mr. Rubble is happily sunbathing. Oops! Who was that? It's Buster and Scout! They're on holiday too! Diggly is finishing off his new sandcastle. That's great, Diggly! Daisy asks Buster to help her build an even bigger one. Look out, Mrs. Skip! Oops! Wow! Look at that! Their castle even has a moat! Diggly and Scout think they can do better. Wow! That's amazing! Hang on a second. Looks like the tide is coming in. It could ruin their sandcastles. Quick everyone, they need to work together to build a wall. Mr. Rubble is fast asleep. The tide! Quick! Oh no! Mrs. Skip! Watch out! Phew! They're okay! What an eventful day at the beach! It's a brand new day at Construction HQ and everyone's excited to start work. But Mr. Rubble looks so tired. Oops, Daisy didn't mean to knock over all the plans. Mm -hmm. There, today's mm -hmm. plans. But something's wrong. Huh? That playhouse doesn't look right. Oh well, if that's what the plans say, that's what they'll build. Now everyone's hard at work, but oh dear, Mr. Rubble is so mm -hmm. sleepy. Surely no one will notice if he has a short nap. But Diggly can't figure this out. Something is definitely wrong with these plans. But what is it? There, the playhouse is nearly finished. They just need a few finishing touches. But oh no, it doesn't stand up properly. This isn't right at all. Here's Mrs. Skip. Looks like she's trying to say something. Hmm, that sign can spin upside down. That's it. The playhouse plans are upside down. That's why it looks all wrong. Now there's just one thing left to do. Three, two, one, jump! There! That woke Mr. Rubble up. But the playhouse is the right way up now. Good job, everyone! It's a fun, snowy day at Construction HQ. I wonder what they're building today. An ice rink? Amazing! Here's the frozen pond. To turn it into a skating rink, they need to put up the soft safety barriers. Mm. Mm. 
Uh oh, Bub's moving the snow, but he's not seen Mr. Rubble. Oops, Mr. Rubble is on the ice. His wheels can't grip. He's sliding. Quick, Digley and Daisy can move the barrier so he doesn't crash. Phew, nice work. But now Mr. Rubble is sliding towards the market stall. Mrs. Skip has to bounce him back. Good job, Mrs. Skip. Bounce, bounce. Mr. Rubble's going back and forth like a ping pong ball. But I think Digley has a plan. They can bounce him into this pile of snow. Daisy's bouncing him towards the snow pile. Whoosh! Is Mr. Rubble okay? Ah, oh, there he is! Good job, everyone! Now the ice rink can be finished in no time! Digley and Daisy are having fun skating on it! But what's this? Skates? Now Mr. Rubble can join in and skate too! Whoa, whoa there! He's got it! It's so much fun to go ice skating! The construction crew are at the park. Look at all those rainbow coloured flower beds. But it looks like some colours are missing. They need to plant the yellow and purple flowers to complete the rainbow. But wait! Mr Rubble has a plan! What's this? Hmm. A robot digger? Mr Rubble is really excited to test the robot. But Diggly and Daisy aren't so sure it's a good idea. Here we go! Time to dig! Wow! Looks like it's working! But now Diggly and Daisy have nothing to do. What's Kitten up to? Oh no! She's taken the remote for the digger! Now the robot is out of control and he's making a mess everywhere! Diggly and Daisy have to do something! Diggly is trying to catch the robot but it's not an easy job! Oh no! Almost Diggly! Daisy is trying to catch Kitten! Oops! Sorry Mr Rubble! The robot is making a huge mess! They need to stop it quickly! Quick Diggly, quick! Phew! Mr Rubble has grabbed Kitten from the tree! Nice work Daisy! And Diggly managed to catch the robot! Phew! That was a close one! The crew have cleaned up all the mess and they planted all the flowers. Great teamwork, guys. They even found a new job for Robot Digger. Well done, everyone. It's a bright new day at Construction HQ. Diggly and Daisy are so excited to see what they'll build today. Oh, wow. A Ferris wheel. This will be so much fun. Now they're at the fairground. The wheel is almost ready. Daisy is just lifting it up. Boing! There, it's finished. But who's going to take a ride in it first? Hooray! Diggly is having a go. Daisy throws the switch and up Diggly goes. But uh oh, something is wrong. Oh dear, the wheel stopped. Diggly is stuck at the top. There must be a way to get him down. Daisy has an idea. Whoosh! A pillow to jump on. I don't think that's going to work. Daisy will have to think of something else. She's off again. Whoosh! Look, now Daisy is trying to pull the wheel round. But it's no good. It's stuck tight. But now she has another idea. Blocks? I wonder what Daisy is up to. Whoa! She's built steps all the way up to Diggly. 
Here's Mrs Skip. Oh wow, she's got a ramp to put on top of the blocks. They can turn it into a giant slide. Whee! That was so much fun. Diggly is fixing the wheel controls. Good as new, the Ferris wheel is ready. But look, Diggly and Daisy just want to use it to slide down the slide. It looks like so much fun. They haven't just built one fairground ride, they've built two. It's the construction crew. They're finishing their work on a new tunnel. Oh, what's that sound? There's been a huge explosion down the mountain. Look, huge rolling snowballs. It's an avalanche. CJ tells the other workers to get inside the tunnel for safety. Dozer pushes Johnny in, there's no time to waste. Diggly rushes to Daisy and tells her to get into the tunnel. The two get in just in time and the snow crashes down behind them. It's really dark in the tunnel. Diggly grabs a lantern and goes to investigate the snowed in entrance. It looks too thick to dig through. Even Johnny can't dig through it. Diggly starts investigating the rest of the tunnel. He can spot something up ahead. There are some train carriages on the tracks. The tracks lead deeper into the tunnel. Diggly thinks that they can get on the train and escape out the other end of the tunnel. The construction crew have all jumped on the train. Dozer is nervous to be at the front. Johnny gives them a push and they're off! Whoa! It's like a giant roller coaster! Look at them go! Whoosh! This looks like fun! Uh oh! There is a snow blockage that they're going to crash into! Construction crew burst through the snow. They're outside and safe. Good job, Diggly and Dozer. It's a sunny day at Construction HQ. Look, Kitten is riding on Mr. Rubble's head. Today, they are demolishing an old factory. <laughs> the crew are removing the bricks from the building, throwing them down the chute to be collected by Mrs. Skip. What's wrong? Oh dear, it's Kitten. They need to get her out of trouble. It could be dangerous. Aha, Diggly's got a plan. She can play with this ball of string. Yay! She loves her new toy. Now the crew can get back to work. Oops! She's tangled up in the ball of string. And now she's rolling around out of control. Watch out, Mr. Rubble. Oh dear. Quick, Daisy. Kitten is going to roll off the edge. Be careful, everyone. Oops! Mm. Now she's bouncing around! Great catch, Diggly! Oops! Oh no! She's heading for the chute! Quick! She's rolling down the chute! Diggly and Daisy couldn't get there in time! Here she comes! The wall has turned into a parachute! Quick, Mr. Rubble! Catch her! Phew! She has landed safe and sound. Well done, Mr. Rubble. What a crazy day. It's another sunny day at Construction HQ. I wonder what they're building today. Oh, nice. A barn. This looks like a good spot to start building. First, they need to lay these planks down. 
Ha ha ha! Nice one, Bum. But what's this? A bunny? Oh no! They're building the barn all over the bunny's home. But I don't think the crew have noticed. The bunnies are definitely not happy. What are they going to do? This bunny has jumped up onto the bricks. What is she doing? She's trying to take one of the bricks. Oh, here comes Bump. I don't think he noticed the bunny. Now Daisy has put some pipes down. And that bunny has pushed them over. And now the bunny has taken that pipe. What are they up to? Now Diggly is laying out his tools. But one of the bunnies is moving his hammer. And now they're moving his screwdriver too. Diggly doesn't get it. Where did his tools go? The whole construction crew are very confused. How do things keep going missing? It's such a mystery. Wait! Now they know the bunnies are the ones moving everything. But why? Oh! They've moved everything into another field. They want the crew to build the barn over there instead. So it's not on top of their rabbit holes. Now Daisy gets it. Now the crew have moved all the building materials into the other field, just like the bunnies wanted. In no time at all, the barn is all finished, all good in the new field. The bunnies are so happy. Well done, team. I wonder what the construction club will learn today. Ooh, I think Mr Rubble is going to teach them how to make concrete. He's mixing cement, gravel, sand, and a little bit of water. Now they're mixing it up really well. And wow, it sets hard as rock. Now it's their turn. Let's do this. Everyone's helping with adding the ingredients and CJ is going to mix them together. One bag of cement, some gravel, some water, Oops, careful! Now all that's left is the sand. But that doesn't look like sand. Good mixing, CJ. Oh dear, that looks more like slime than cement. Whoa! Let's try it again. One bag of cement, one of gravel and one of sand. That's a lot of water, Diggly. Go, CJ, go! That looks better. Oh, but it's too splashy. Oh, no. Bad luck, Mr. Rubble. Third time lucky. Sand, then cement, some gravel, and just a bit of water. Well done, everyone. Now mix, mix, mix. Look out, Mr. Rubble. Oh no, he's stuck. But wait, the concrete is perfect. Well done, crew. They earned their concrete mixing badges for making a perfect batch of concrete. But they might need to help Mr. Rubble out now. <laughs> it's the construction crew, hard at work building the foundations for a brand new building. Uh-oh, I think it's going to rain. I don't like the look of those storm clouds. Time to get cover. Wait, there's Scout. Watch out, Scout. She's skidding. Careful, Daisy. Oh dear, oh dear. Daisy accidentally hit the girders. Look out, everyone. The whole thing is falling down. Oh no. Scout is trapped down that pit with the girders on top. You have to get her out quick, guys, before the rainwater fills the pit up. I think Diggly is going to move the girders first. Wait, careful. Those girders could oh. fall on top of Scout. That was a close one. I think CJ the cement mixer has an idea. Oh, I see. If we use cement to stick all the girders together, we can drag them out in one go. Clever. Go on, Dozer. Drag those heavy girders out of the way. Great, now the girders are gone. It's up to Diggly and Johnny to dig Scout a way out. Hurry up, guys. 
The water is getting deeper. You can do it. Diggly and Johnny are digging as fast as they can. Almost there. There, you did it. <laughs> Scout can drive out now. Well done, Diggly and Johnny. You saved the day in the nick of time. And look now, the sun is coming out again. Good job, everyone. See you again next time. Thank you.